Oh. Guys, you're not gonna believe this, but I think I'm dead. Really? What a coincidence, me too. Yeah guys, me too. I just randomly, spontaneously combusted. I think it was a lightning strike for me. Yeah, I was hit by some sort of missile. You know, I always knew I'd go out like that. All right guys, what's the plan? I know we're dead, but that doesn't mean we still can't have some fun. You guys still up for making that movie? I mean, yeah, my plans for the rest of my life were just changed, so why not? What if we still went to Tim's house? It's not like he's doing anything. And now we have even more ways we can mess with him. Foster, I love the way you think. Let's go scare the piss out of him. Oh, man. All right, boys, what do you say we give Timmy a good old fashioned haunting? That'd be pretty fun to film, right? You guys know how popular prank compilations are these days? Why don't we just start with the basics? Oh yeah, a ding-dong ditching doesn't get more classic than that. Silas, set up your camera right here. We can get the perfect reaction shot of Tim when he comes out. We don't even have to ditch anyway, since we, he won't be able to see us. All right, uh, Jones, you're on Ding Dong Dude. Go up, press that doorbell, and get out of the way so we can get a clean shot of Tim. Roger, Captain. And... Action! Hit it again, Jones. All right, now let's really mess with him. Hit it while he's still out here, Jones. Did you get that, Silas? Nice! Yeah. Man, being dead has more perks than I thought. <laughs> well, what's next? I mean, I think we're really on to something here. Let's give him a moment to recover before we hit him again. In the meantime, we can plan our next master prank. Yeah! yeah.
Silas, what was that? I just wanted to get in on the prank. Prank? That wasn't a prank, you killed him! Foster? Jones? Silas? You're the ones who've been doing this to me the whole time? <laughs> yeah, man. You should have seen your face when we pulled that chair out from under you. <laughs> or when we loosened the cap on the salt shaker. <laughs> that was priceless. <laughs> Actually, he can see his face. We're going to have it all right here on video. Oh, yeah! yeah. Silas McVeigh, Foster Milgram, Jones Jones. You have thwarted the path set forth by your destinies and have escaped hell's cold grasp. By my powers, as reaper of souls, I hereby banish... Wait, who, who the hell is that? Oh shit! Oh, you're not supposed to be here! Wait, 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 wait. Did you guys kill him? Uh, yeah. I guess our haunting pranks might have gotten slightly out of hand. I, I guess that means all four of us are going... Downstairs? Wait, what are you talking about? You said that they broke the rules of death, right? So if they're not supposed to be here, then I'm not supposed to be dead. Uh, excuse me, Mr. Reaper, sir. Uh, but are you seriously gonna listen to this guy? I mean, he's scared of his own shadow. He probably would've died soon anyway. Honestly, I have no idea how I'm supposed to handle this. <sighs> Let me call my boss and see what she says. All right. Looks like I'm just gonna have to figure this thing out on my own. She's not picking up. Alright, the three of you rascals are definitely coming with me. I missed you the first time and I'm not letting you get away again. <laughs> well, what about me? I'm not going with them? No, it was definitely my fault that they were here in the first place, so you're not supposed to be dead. This is super unorthodox, but I think I'll just give you a second chance. You mean bring me back to life? Yeah, I'll be back for you when you inevitably kick it. So just hang tight in the meantime. I gotta go deal with the schmucks that killed you. So have a nice life. <laughs>